First of all, uh, first one is about the Beatles manager. Um, so a letter from the Beatles manager following the sacking of the band's original drummer is up for auction. Did you know that the Beatles had a, a drummer? Yes. Before? You did? Yes, I can't remember his name now. Um, uh, yeah, my my mum saw uh, the Beatles with the original drummer at the Coven Club um, back in the 60s. <laughs> back in the day. Back in the day. So, um, yeah, uh, yeah, I, I knew they had a, a, a different drummer. Um, I'm not too sure why he left. No, uh, I mean, it says, it says Brian uh, Epstein signed up Paul McCartney, John Lennon, George Harrison, and Pete Best, he was called. Pete Best, that's it, yeah, yeah. 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 He was the band's first drummer in January 1962 after seeing him at mm. the Cabin Club. There you go, Rich. So your mum was there, was oh, she? Wow. My mum was probably there, yeah. Yeah, she always <laughs> oh, tells cool. the story. Yeah, she... Um... Oh, no, was it, it was, was it at the Cabin Club? It was, it was... I don't... Maybe it wasn't at the Cabin Club because my mum's from Warrington, so it's probably around that area that makes more sense mm. but i remember her saying she said um you know that she had to uh, she had to pay a little bit more to get in because they were a good band <laughs> <laughs> they were they were a popular you know they obviously they weren't famous then but they were they were a good no. band so people had to pay a little bit more yes i think they went quite uh, <laughs> quite big didn't they yeah 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 uh, there's um i think uh pete best I could be completely wrong, but I think he wrote a book um, mm. about because this is someone who left a band to then went on to be arguably the biggest band in the world. Mm. Um, and that feeling, I mean, wow, I mean, that is that's something, isn't it? Yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet, the, I bet Pete was a bit pig sick after he got the sack. It's because it said. Uh, okay. uh, he, he got he got fired some months later and uh, it doesn't say why but then was replaced obviously by um, as we all know Ringo Starr 